With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Let us start with our question. In this question, what has been given that electrostatic force of repulsion between two positively charged uh, ions carrying equal charge. Equal charge is given as to be 3.7 into 10 to the power minus 9 Newton. Okay. Now, uh, when these are separated by a distance of 5 angstroms, this is given as angstrom. How many electrons are missing from each ion? So, how many electrons these are missing from each ion? We need to find it. Okay. Now, what are the values which have been given? We have been given with the of value of the force. This is given as to be 3.7 into 10 to the power minus 9 Newton. Okay. Now, uh, and the distance or the separation between them is given as to be, we can write here as 5 angstrom or we can say that 5 into 10 to the power minus 10 meter. We can write it like this. Now, the charge, these are equal charge. Okay. Equal charge. That means the charge on Q1 would be equal to charge on Q2. This is given. And what would be this charge equal to? Now, why will there be any charge? charge will be due to uh, if they, these are positively charged that means they must have lose electron. So, uh, the number of electron that would be lost by them would be equal to the charge. So, for example, if 3 electrons are uh, if uh, n equals to 3 for them for example, let us say n equals to 3. So, what would be the value of the charge? So, we need to just multiply this charge n by the value of the charge on a single electron which is equal to 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 or we can just generally we can uh, we write it here as Q equals to n into e. We write here as Q equals to n into e. We can just rub this part. Okay. Uh, that means this we have understood that uh, if there are n number of electrons which have been missing, so what would be the charge? Charge would be n into e, where e is what? e is 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19. Okay. Now, how will we proceed? It is very simple now. Why? Because we have been given with the force, we know the charges and we know the distance. So, what is the value of force by given as 1 by 4 pi epsilon? We know that 1 by 4 pi epsilon. Then it is Q1, Q2 divided by distance between them square of distance between them okay now what is the value of f which is given as to be 3.7 it is given as to be 3.7 into 10 to the power minus 9 what is the value of 1 by 4 pi epsilon it is 9 into 10 to the power 9 what is the value of q1 and q2 these values are same it is n e into n e so what would be this n into e ka square n into e square okay divided by what is the value of r r is 5 into 10 to the power minus 10 so, 5 into 10 to the power minus 10 square. Okay. Now, uh, what would be the value of any square would come? We can just substitute the value of any because we know that E is equals to uh, uh, 1.6. We can write here as N into 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 square. This would be equals to 3.7 into 10 to the power minus 9 into 5 into 10 to the power minus 10 square whole divided by this would be divided by 9 into 10 to the power 9. Okay, we can write uh, it is like this. Okay, uh, then next it would be n into 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 square. Now, if you were to solve this part, uh, if you were to solve this part, the value of this would come out to be 1.027 into 10 to the power minus 37. Okay, we need to square 5 then multiply it by 3.7 and then divide it by 9 and then adjust the power. So, it would come out to be like this. So, what is the value of n into 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19? So, we need to take the square root. So, if we take the square root of this term, what would be the value of the square root which would be coming? It would be equal to approximately equal to 3.2 into 10 to the power minus 19. It would be like this. So, 10 to the power 19, 10 to the power minus 19, that would get cancelled. Then x, uh, sorry, n value would be equal to 3.2 divided by 1.6. So, n would be equal to 3.2 divided by 1.6. So, it would be equal to 2. That means two uh, electrons would be missing. So let us check uh, what have we, uh, what has been asked. Number of electron that are missing from the each ion. So n equals to two. So in our case, there are two electrons which have been missing from both these uh, positively charged ions. So hope you have understood this explanation. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITG and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.